Today, we are going to talk with you about the ozone treatment and its effect on the heat transfer surgery. First of all, what's the, an ozone treatment or ozone therapy? An ozone is a molecule of oxygen that have three electrons inside. The standard oxygen has two electrons, so it's a kind of enriched oxygen. The positive effects of the ozone treatment has been known for a long time. It's a really good complementary treatment in many fields of the medicine. Most of the time it's used in the inc to increase the microcirculation across the tissue and decrease the oxidative stress in the tissues. It's also used in chronic diseases, cancer treatment as a complementary to many therapies. So the main role of the ozone treatment or ozone therapy is to increase the microcirculation and enrichment of the tissues with the oxygen, giving them a really strong antioxidant effect. As we mentioned previously, ozone treatment is used in many fields of the medicine in many diseases. But are there any contraindications or the aspects or the patients for whom the ozone treatment is not good? Yes, there are. If you're in the first trimester of your pregnancy. Number two, if you have an uncontrolled thyroid disease. Number three, if you have any bleeding disorder. And finally, if you have a G6PD deficiency disease. In this population of the patients, the ozone treatment is contraindicated. Ozone treatment can be a really good complementary treatment during the heat transfer surgery. It's to increase the microcirculation that is a crucial for the surveillance of the newly transplanted grafts. Because as we know, ozone treatment or enriched oxygen molecule carries more oxygen to the tissues, enriches it, and has really strong antioxidant effect. And that significantly impacts the outcomes of the surgery. And finally, are there any complications during the ozone treatment or ozone therapy? Ozone or ozone molecule is an enriched oxygen. So it's a, a natural substance that exists in our nature. During its degradation or metabolism, the ozone splits into the regular molecules of the oxygen. So it has almost no or close to the zero side effects. Most of the time, the side effects are seen when ozone treatment is used with the blood. But in this hair transfer surgery, in mostly during the ozone treatment, it's used with the saline solution. So its risks are minimal and we haven't seen it till now. As we have mentioned before, ozone gas or ozone is a natural substance or enriched molecule of the oxygen. The classic oxygen molecule has two electrons. In ozone has three molecules or electrons of the oxygen. Ozone is synthesized by specific machines or devices in the laboratories or in the medical center. We use the 100% pure oxygen to synthesize the ozone and it's used with the saline solution. During the surgery or just by the end of the surgery, it's given via IV solution.